Led by Green Global Footprint founder Ratimo Mwabea, the initiative which was founded last year was developed with the aim of looking into long-term sustainability and e-mobility. The group of six were in their final years in university pursuing engineering, decided to invest in charging infrastructure of electric vehicles to be installed in places including parking lots, workspaces and home environs. Our initiative basically uh, you know, came out of uh, words of uh, Mayor Motali at the COP27 that we all have a collective responsibility to transform. And, and uh, uh, there are a lot of perceived barriers to EV adoption. Things like charging infrastructure, range anxiety. Uh, people are skeptic about um, elect electric mobility. The exhibition which took place at Karura Forest showcased diverse players in the EV industry including motorbikes, three-wheeler motors, bicycles as well as electric scooters. While it was open for the general public, the occasion was geared towards creating awareness while fighting misconception and skepticism around electric vehicles adoption. I would like to encourage the youths that since we are energetic, eh, we are not doing this for us, we are doing this for, for our future generations. Yeah, I will, the youth should come strong in, in this in matters related to climate change so that we save this planet, it's getting hot and hotter each day. According to the team, lack of enough charging infrastructure still poses a challenge including lack of trained personnel as well as clients who understand the product. Including the bus. While celebrating the milestones that e-mobility has made since beginning of operations last year, industry players are still raising concerns on the high cost of importation of the vehicle parts. They are battery koju kwa soko kwa sababu ya yale kemikali ama yale mchanganyiko ambao unatumika pale ndani unapata kwamba tuna tu, uh, uh, mat, hizo material ambazo zinahitajika hata katika soko huru hazipatikani kwa urahisi so imekuwa bado katika utafiti kuweza kutafuta njia mwafaka na njia tofauti zile ambazo wanaweza kuweza kupata njia lingine kuweza as an all-electric future is inevitable for the automobile industry, adoption is still slow. However, research shows by 2040, electric vehicles will make for more than 50% of car sales. Gertrude Bourguet, K24 Nairobi.